This morning, the developer of a controversial project in Huntersville now says it's all over. The Laguna Bay project, later known as Waterside, initially promised a 270 acre beach style resort in northern Mecklenburg County, but the community quickly fired back. Wake Up Charlotte's Destiny Richards joins us now in Destiny. So many people sharing their thoughts with us on social media, both in support and against canceling the project. That's right, Laguna Bay faced pushback really from the beginning. And the developer, Jake Palillo, says he has no regrets about calling off the whole thing. Plans for a resort-style development in Huntersville are no more. The mixed-use development would have featured housing options, retail, a membership clubhouse, dining, and a convention center, all built around a man-made lagoon. The zoning played the biggest factor. You know, when they, we, when they, when they disallowed the, the density, and reduce the density and reduce the use, then you create more element of risk. Jake Palillo with Bipart Development tells WCNC Charlotte there were not only zoning problems, but he would have had to adjust the design and he didn't want to downsize. Palillo also blames the economy. A for sale sign is already back up on the property where Laguna Bay would have been built, but it's a win for those who have been saying Laguna Nay from the start. Your constituents have already very clearly told you what they want. And it's definitely not a big touristy circus and cement pond in this peaceful little rural area. While it was ultimately Palillo's decision to walk away, he's still taking a hit. If you call 800000 a lot of money, yeah, that's what I'm going to lose. And Palillo says with the Laguna Bay project gone, it's only a matter of time before another developer picks up where he left off, but he's on to the next one. Live in Huntersville this morning, I'm Destiny Richards, Wake Up Charlotte.